Hey there, Julianne. I'm uh, Travis. Just wanted to say hi. It's always nice to put a face behind the name there. Uh, let you know who you're dealing with. Um, but here's a little video on the truck there. I did have a little walk around on it. It is in uh, very good condition there. A uh, couple of minor rock chipping. I'll show you on the video there anyways, on the one fender on the rear there. Um, but I'll, I'll show you that in the video, try to give you as much detail into the truck as I can, make it as uh, easy and as streamless a process as possible for you there. So here's the truck. It is the uh, Summit White in color. Um, it does have the 3M film on the front of it here, so that's going to help protect uh, the front end from rock chipping and that sort of thing. Uh, got the signature LED running lights, HID headlights. Uh, I did check the tires. The front ones here seem to be at about 630 seconds. Uh, 7.30 seconds. Back ones were, one was 8, one was 6.30 seconds. So they're not new, but they're not uh, worn right out by any means. I'll try to give you as uh, good a video as I can here. You can pause it, zoom in, zoom out uh, on any specific part of the truck that you want there does have the GMC mud flaps on the back of it and then uh, like I was saying there the back ones there at about nine uh, eight and a half nine millimeters it does have your tow hitch here for a conventional with wiring harness and then as well as uh, the fifth wheel prep package so it's got the wiring harness there gooseneck ball is included it's got nice spray in box liner gonna keep that box protected for you there um, but no no big dings or anything like that uh, overall body is in excellent condition there Just give me a few on these ones here and then this is what I was talking about I'm not sure how well it shows up on the screen there but just on that one rear fender there a little bit of rock chipping can be touched up with a with a paint pen there Try to give you a little bit of the passenger side here. It's got the running boards on it there already. Trailering mirrors, they are extendable. So when you do got the horse trailer on there, you just pull them right out to extend them, give you a better view. But, uh, let's have a look at the inside. Alrighty, so having a look at the inside here. Again, the interior is in uh, really good condition still. A nice storage area underneath the seat there if you're looking for cargo space a little power point back there and it's got rubber floor mats there as well center armrest with cup holders for passengers in the back and then the uh, important seat have a look at the driver's seat there so you got your power windows power mirrors uh, power driver's seat Got your integrated trailer brake right there. It's nice, easy to get at. You're not banging your knees off it when it's down in by the steering wheel here. Automatic headlights, your four wheel drive controls, shift on the fly, cruise control, uh, digital information screen in behind the steering wheel there. So it's gonna tell you your def level, fuel filter. Does have a new fuel filter on it. Uh, fuel economy, oil life, all that sort of stuff. Digital speedometer. It's got the uh, heated seats for driver and passenger, traction control and stability track. This will be for your cargo lighting, as well as to turn on your lights on the uh, mirror there. So make it nice and easy for if you're loading stuff at nighttime to bright, brighten up the side of the vehicle there. Dual climate control, so you need to have your own temperatures with, uh, with an auto setting. Uh, eight inch touch screen, uh, Bluetooth capabilities, as well as Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Uh, that's what the projection screen is there so when you plug your cell phone in through a usb port uh, any compatible apps will come up right on the touch screen there um, replaces the need to have the built-in navigation and then you can run google maps and that sort of thing right off the screen does have the bench in the front storage in the center console there and then as well you can have the extra passenger up there in the front or another little storage area underneath that seat up here you got your integrated garage door openers and then uh, a little spot for the old sunglasses there. But uh, that's it. Overall, truck is in uh, really excellent condition. Uh, perfect truck for I think what you guys needed to do, pull your horse trailer around.